Hello and welcome back to Darksiders. If you're truly loaded into the mad high load, the first is already just quickening. Those don't need to boxes, my good is fucking this 13 and the run neutral guy. What's up with this chest now? Has it just pitched out? I suppose that's possible. Oh well. Open the door and face the, face the queen, Kinky. The chosen. And be annoyed by the cutscene. Oh, actually, I can skip it because I've already shown it to you once. So, um. How should I handle this? Like that? Seems like a valid option. Nope. No still holding this. None. What is he doing now? Or don't struggle, it'll be over soon. I think he tried to do that sword attack from the dodging move maneuver. This isn't very useful when we're trying to run away. Hold still, one. No. You hold still. So you can stab your face. I just try to survive. Barely. Yes, sounds like it. Sounds, I mean, looks like it. Come on. It's really annoying though that uh, when you reload to a point where you previously got health, there is no longer health there, so you kind of don't have health during the boss fight. Really annoying. Because I can't survive this shit. <laughs> it's my own fault for being bad at the game, but still. God damn it. Now I'm dead again because there's no way I can survive this shit. Come on. Drop on me. Hack. There we go. Giving it an additional try. Still annoyed that the chest is broken. Not in the best mood right now, am I? Nope. Come on. Ah, shit. Maybe I should time when I dodge. Ah, shit. Don't struggle. It'll be over soon. But this was a good dodge. This was a good dodge. This was an unnecessary dodge. Can I get close to her yet? Oh, for fuck's sake! Why is the chain so bloody short all of a sudden? Or is she just that bloody large? Oh for fuck's sake. Come on. I should try this game with a gamepad, maybe. Might be less fucking annoying. Come on. 
Get there. You're late. The biggest problem with being too late is the fact that she kills you. Get over here. I can just kill you, you bloody hack. Stop teleporting around. Ah. Didn't get much in the basic damage in there. This is dodging that one. What is she planning? That, of course. I think I made her angry. Oh, for fuck's sake, now we don't have anything to focus on. What's going on? What are those things? Oh. Oh, this, that sort of things. Oh, fuck. There are also bombs. The point of that exercise is to lash onto them. You know? The point of that exercise is to not get hit, apparently. Because that doesn't work. Ah, oh, yeah, it's just a small attempt of hers to kill me. An opportunity for me to try to kill her, apparently. Ah, let's refocus. Hey girl, I want your heart. Oh, and now we're back in that state. Um, can be used as a teleportation technique. Ah, for fuck's sake. I should have held it down or something, probably. So that is the only way to currently harm her. It's problematic because I'm not very good at this. Come on! Is the chain really that short? Oh, for fuck's sake. Now they're falling down again. So... The window of, window of opportunity has been lost. Whatever she does now, I stand no chance. So I can re-attempt once she's in the ceiling, again. Which is annoying, especially considering this nonsense. Okay. Come on! Get on that shit! Oh, hello! Holy shit! <laughs> Peter was so bloody certain I would not be able to kill her this episode. One mean mother has been slain. And I get another lifestone. Which means I get my health maxed out. Samael will be waiting for the last heart. You think he's going to let you live long enough to collect on your end? Uh If it comes down to it, we should be able and kill him. Oh, is that a 
Wait, what is it? What is that? That's something I need to hurt. So, um... Oh, shite. Come back here! No! Oh well. Is there an alternative exit here? Yes, there is. Good. Oh. Oh, so... I think it's time to go exploring. Because... I think I have all the maneuvering items now. Don't I? Which means I can go and collect loot from everywhere. Also, um, how do I horse? That's how I horse. Good. Let's get out of this spider abyss nightmare. Sounds like a plan to me. Where is the closest volume location again? I kinda forgot. And I'm also kinda drinking tea. Because tea is good. Tea is delicious. Tea is amazing. Tea is fantastic. Alright, this helps me go faster. Can I max out? Look at this. Um, what is that? Oh, that's that. Right, horsey. Let's go. Was the ballroom anywhere near here? Don't even remember. Anyway, what I do remember is the fact that. Oh, shite. I shouldn't use a horse one up there, like that. Okay, so. Let's give this shit a try. That is. That is. That is dumb. Just, that is just simply stupid. Get over there. Go, 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 let's go. I'm actually looking for something. They don't remember which tower was the right tower for this nonsense. I think it may have been this one. Yeah, it is. But since this one is not thrilling, I can just climb it. Good. You see, the plan right now is to not raise attention to what the fuck the frame rate is doing. Uh, let's just keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Yeah, uh, you see, there is that thing over there. And I'm using the wrong item. Well, um, can I just... Oh, hello! That makes things a lot easier, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Then I can shut this down. Which, surprise, surprise, give me, gives me access to something very, very valuable. Thank you, Interwebs, for letting me know. I was actually looking for information on the on the Soul Bridge stuff when I accidentally found this one. This emblem bears the mark of the tyrannical general of the Legion armies. His name has long since been forgotten, but the husk of his formidable strength still lingers within this totem. Return it to Valgrim, and he will reward you. Anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.